This is the second screencast for Final Cut. In this screencast, we're going to be going over the layout of Final Cut and uh, going over some tools that are most commonly used. So as you can see in the browser area on the top left, we've already imported the uh, video clips from last time. And of course, there can be video clips, there can be images, and there can be audio clips. Uh, now, if you double-click one of these clips, it will appear in the viewer here, and this viewer is used to kind of scrub through your, your raw clips and set in and out points with the I and O button to mark uh, which parts of the clips you want to use. Uh, down here is your timeline, which represents your, your project as you're working on it, and so you'll often see um, you know multiple audio clips and you can make more than one video track so you can have layers upon layers of video and layers upon layers of audio and um, up here in the top right this is the canvas and this is the uh, whereas the viewer is the player for your raw clips in the browser the canvas is your player for your completed project in the timeline. So right now this is playing what's on the timeline. Now some of the most uh, commonly used tools would be the selection tool which is uh, hotkey is the A button and that lets you kind of select what's on the timeline and then you can then drag that back and forth. Uh, the blade tool which is a hotkey is B and that uh, will make you will help you to make cuts in your clips so I'm cutting this clip up and these are all now separate things so I can move this independently of the rest of it uh, the pen tool which is used to um, fade clips in and out and manipulate the audio levels in your clips so if I click on this down here, which is the toggle clip overlays button, just like in GarageBand, there is the line that represents your audio levels, and there is also a line that represents uh, the opacity of your video. And that can be manipulated by making points on the line and dragging it up or down. And the last tool that is most commonly used is the uh, Select Track Forward tool. And that is to select uh, multiple tracks. Right now the arrow is pointing to the right. So if I click here, it will select everything to the right of this clip, like so. OK, well, those are the most used tools in uh, the next screencast will go over making subclips in, in the viewer.